In this video, we're going to get to do one of my favorite things. An unboxing video. I haven't done one in a while. Let's do it. So this box here, we're going to open up. This one's coming from Tucson, Arizona. Aw, isn't that cute? A little bag. All right, inside this little bag though, we have, ah uh, yes, this guy, a Nikon Light Touch Zoom AF. I have never actually purchased one of these before. This I saw untested, did a little digging. I've never come across one of these, nor have I thought of buying one. So I dug into it a little bit and this thing actually will sell for, I believe like around a hundred dollars. This camera I picked up for $21. Next camera comes from Bradford, Illinois. Canon Sure Shot is the box. It actually came with a box. It's got a lot of paperwork with it. That's great. Nice. Comes with a case. And this is the Sure Shot, as it says on the box. Um, this basic, simple Canon AF 35M. Um, and this is the Sure Shot, sure Shot version. Now, this one I picked up untested and I say that in quotes for a reason and I will explain to that in a second. I picked this camera up for $33. This one was listed as parts not working uh, but with these cameras and anything that takes AA batteries by now I know what cameras take at AA batteries. Here's the catch with AA battery cameras. Even though people say they're parts or even though they say it's untested, they are capable of testing that camera, right? If I contact them and I say, hey, do you mind throwing a couple AA batteries in there and pressing the button and letting me know if it works? Nine times out of 10, they'll write back and they'll either tell me that it's nothing's happening and at that point, I can just move on to the next listing. But sometimes they'll write back and say, it sounds like it's actually taking a photo. I just don't have film to test it. I don't know how to do it. And that's what I'm looking for. And that's the trick with these cameras. I've gotten burned by a ton of these cameras when I first started. All these Canon cameras, the AF35M, Sure Shot, um, the ML, you name it. I got burned a lot because they were lit selling as untested. I would quickly jump on them. And these cameras, for whatever reason, have lots of issues with battery corrosion, lots of just issues in general. These are old cameras from the 80s. I almost stopped buying these because I had so many cameras that were just junk. I realized that, well, what if I just ask them to put a couple AA batteries in there and press the button and see what happens? And sure enough, people wrote back saying, hey, I just put AA batteries in, and yes, it sounds like it shutters, and hey, what do you know, the flash fires. And that's where this is. Normally I try to stay under $30 for untested, but the, re the answer that they gave me back, at this point I'm confident that it at least fires. That's kind of the trick with these AA battery cameras, even the Nikon One Touches, all of those as well. I will always send a message uh, about, hey, does it, does it at least anything happen when you press the button? I mean, it's harmless of asking, and most people will write you back, so it's a really good tip there. This one, untested, will sell for, uh, once tested, about 100 bucks. So that's a pretty good profit there. For now, if you want to learn how to buy and sell flip cameras, go ahead and make sure you subscribe to this channel and also like this video. Thanks for watching.